Good morning, guys. This is Ed from Rise and Shine. I'm back out here on, well, I didn't video the first one I was out here on Millerton Lake, but I figured I'd get this one on footage. Didn't catch a whole lot. The bite is real hard here. Um, I'm gonna see what I can do today. The water level kind of came up a little bit. So let's see if we can put a few in the boat, show you guys what we catch. So come along, hang out with me. I'll get back with you in a minute. All right, guys, we made it to the water. Uh, the water level came up a little bit. So I noticed that they moved the ramp from the first ramp to the second ramp. So it came up a lot. Maybe that might make a difference. I was here a couple of weeks ago, like I was telling you earlier, and the bite just wasn't there, man. You couldn't even buy a fish here. So <clears throat> you could see them on the graph. I could see them. I just couldn't get them to commit to any kind of bait, anything I was throwing. So I'm wearing my lucky hat today. We're gonna see how that do. See if I can catch some fish with that. The last time I didn't have it on, so we'll see if that makes a difference. Uh, stay tuned. Hang out with me, and uh, if I catch anything, I'll show you guys. If I don't, it's one of those days. You just don't catch them all the time. And uh, anybody who says that they do, wow, let me fish with that guy. I need to learn up under that guy, that girl. All right, so I'll get back with you as soon as we get to our spot. And uh, draft around a little bit, check some little, some little pockets I had looked into, see if there's any fish there. There's some there, we'll catch them. All right, stay tuned. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna back the, my sonar up. And I'm gonna take you to where they at. And there they are. What I've done is I've set waypoints all the way down. And now I'm gonna go back and see if I can catch them. Stay tuned. Take it. So this is how you do it guys. I mean, it's 40 feet deep. I barely could feel that bite. Barely, barely could feel it. I, mean, I barely could feel that bite. But we gotta take it. I don't feel very big, but whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't feel very big. Oh my god, it's the biggest one I ever caught. This is the biggest fish I ever caught. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Look at that. Look at that. 
it's not the biggest fish I ever caught, but it felt, it looked like it in the water. So you see what we did? We marked those fish. We seen them down there, we marked them. And we come back and we catch them. Let's put them in the live wheel, get some weight. Just fun, I love it. <laughs> So, let me explain to you again what we did, right? So I come down this blank, this bank, this rock, sand, mixed. So we might be working on a little pattern here. We might be working on a little pattern. So we're gonna drop back down there on spot lock right now. And so how I marked them is on my graph, I marked them in a straight line. So they're marked in a straight line. And what I did is I just pulled in between the two waypoints that I had put down. And, uh, and I'm fishing in between that. You barely can feel that bite. They're like 40, 50 feet deep. Barely can feel it. But we're catching them. Let's see, can we get another one? throwing down it's just a tough time of the year in the winter time it's just hard to catch fish um, anybody can tell you that but you can catch them don't get me wrong you can catch them so you just have to stay with it use your graphs use whatever uh, electronics you have and uh, you find them you catch them and it's all fun I had a nice time today uh, I enjoy bringing you guys along with me I hope you guys enjoy coming along with me and uh, if you like what I'm, uh, the, like the content that I'm putting out, hit the like button, uh, subscribe, and uh, peace. We'll catch you on the next one.